right I just want to show you um, how to build this pump basically what you're doing is you're just building the the thermostat that's the thermostat it's it looks different from the thermostat that we know okay that's the thermostat it this is the housing so I removed the water pump the old one that was damaged and now uh, I'm reusing this one comes without a new thermostat they don't come complete so you have to take from the old had my thermostat not been working I would have just bought another thermostat but the thermostat is not an issue what was the problem was the pump the bearing uh, it, on the pulley collapsed right so if you look inside I uh, yeah if you look inside you can see that there is a that sits in like that okay and this is the the housing that's the the wee plastic cover so water comes in here all right and there's a gasket in there i've reused the old gasket because this pump came with no gasket but this is what i'm doing i have put in there silicone and this is uh, the special silicone uh, it's a Loctite 574 uh, it's an aerobic uh, silicone what it does is if I leave it like that it will not dry out it will not dry up at all it stays fresh as long as it is not compressed it will stay fresh so I can take off the lead on this one and just and leave it like that I can come back in a year's time it will still be the same right or whenever i found out this one i i fell in love with this type of of of, uh, of silicon okay so this is my silicon that I'm, I'm, I'm my favorite that i use now so what what i want to do now it's simple steps uh that part there goes in that pin goes in in there you see in there so the pin that you see goes in there so uh, I would want maybe to take it out, put it in there, okay, set it in there, and then and then I can now put it in its place. All right, so you can see that it is spring loaded. It is spring loaded, so you you'll have to do a little bit of compressing. As you can see, there's there's space there. So let me see. Well, the bolts will tighten, okay. Um, look, I just decided to make a short video here in case you know someone wants to replace a thermostat on a BMW 5 Series. This is a 530D, it's a GT. Uh, it's a massive, massive engine. Okay. Unfortunately, the water pump collapsed. So now, I can use a 10 socket. And tighten that. want to go diagonally so that it sits properly so it's okay okay and
So now that this is now airtight, the silicone will dry up. The moment oxygen is taken out of the way, it will now dry up. So um, there's not much to it. That's now a complete water pump. It sits, sits in like that on the, on, on the car. Okay, that's how you, you mount it. And the pipe comes from the left side and goes into the thermostat housing. So yeah, that's a complete water pump. I thought I should show you how the thermostat sits. Hopefully this will help somebody. Please, if you are happy with this, um, subscribe to my channel. I'll be posting another video showing you how to remove the water pump and how to fit it back on. So that's, a, that's the project that I'm on. Uh, so you'll see the rest of it on the other video. But I'll just post this video as just for the thermostat so that you can see. Thank you very much. I hope you'll appreciate that. So this is what you see looking from the back of, of the pump, okay? This is the back profile. Uh, so there's our thermostat and there's the spring in there, okay? So that's the impeller. Um, make, make sure this is metal because most of them, some of them are plastics and to be honest with you, they are not strong at all. Uh, they do break. So here's the gasket. I've, I've put the gasket. They supply this gasket. Okay, it's good to use a new one, um, but still, I am going to put my Loctite silicone. I'm not taking chances. This job is a big job. I do not want to go back again and start collect correcting things. I don't trust this gasket alone. Okay, it can do the trick, I know, but I do not want to take chances. So I'll put a little bit of, you know, silicone uh, ar around, you know, following this gasket. And then that would be it. So I thought I should, you know, show you behind as well, what is behind, you know, because I had only shown you the front view of this BMW 5 Series water pump. Thank you.